In this video, I am going to become a sword main for the first time. Huh? If you don't know what I mean by that, basically, I'm going to be focusing all my damage on my sword. And in order to do that, we have to reset our stats. So we're going to go ahead and refund these with the Robux we have. And then change all our points and put them into sword and defense and melee. So we're, it's going to look a little something like this. But I am also going to make this video very interesting. I'm not going to do no Buddha spam with no swords. And I'm not going to use any of the mainstream swords that everybody and their mothers use. Instead, I'm going to use the swords that are very uncommon. For example, I'm going to go ahead and use something like the Midnight Blade. Occasionally, you see people use this, but it is not as used as the Cursed Dual Katanas or something like that, right? And for the fruit, to be honest, it doesn't even matter what fruit I use. But I'm going to go ahead and stick with Portal for now. But first, before we even get into this, huh? look at how overpowered and how cool this sword looks. If we go ahead and use the Z ability, look at this. Look at that thing, bro. That does so much cool effects. And if we do the X ability... It has like a nice dash built in and it has like area of effect. If you notice, it took out more than one person right there. But that's enough showboating. Let's go ahead and go to the jungle real quick and go roll a fruit like we do in every number school video. Come on, boys. It's not a number school video without rolling a fruit. Am I right? So let's go ahead and see what we get here. Come on, blocks, fruit, gods, Mr. Ziolez. And oh my gosh, bro hates me with a burning passion. He gave me a chop root. Hey, buddy, do you want this fruit? Because I don't want it. Using my observation, I noticed a max level player chilling here. Is he AFK or is he here? Does he even have his PvP on? And he absolutely does. Let's go ahead and try comboing, bro. And wait, does he even have the shark race? Oh, he does. Okay, this is a little bit troubling here because now we're gonna have to try to combo him mid-air while everything's on cooldown. And oh, he ran away. Where the heck did bro go? He portaled over to Coliseum. Let's go ahead and hit him with the crescent dash. And there we go. 11.3 thousand bounty. He was AFK for the first, but he tried to get away. But the Midnight Blade does not very forgiving. And using my observation again, I noticed a Buddha user over here. Let's go ahead and see if we can melt a Buddha user while being a sword main. I don't even know. Is that even possible? Can sword mains melt Buddha users? Users, huh? Especially an awakened Buddha user. Look at bro just walking around in the water over there. Bro is clueless. Little does he know that cheek clapping is awaiting him. Let's go see what's up with bro real quick. I'm gonna go ahead and hit him with the Portal Z ability. And there we go. Oh, he's got his observation on. So he dodged all of it. He's even got the hollow scythe and everything. Hold on. Is bro strong enough to like even deal damage to me? He's max level, but I feel like his damage does not exist. Let's go ahead and portal him back into the floor here. Go ahead and hit him with another god human combo. He's even got the soul guitar. Bro kind of tickles. I'm not gonna lie. He's got electric claw fighting style. Oh, and his observation dodged that. Where the heck is bro going? We're gonna go ahead and try god humaning him. Go ahead and do that and try to portal opening him again. There we go. It takes so many combos to kill a Buddha user doing this stuff. This is ridiculous. Okay, he's drowning underwater, but he can't really drown because he's an awakened Buddha user. <laughs> this is so weird. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and finish him off with god human. Another 11.3 thousand bounty from somebody else, but jeez. Sword users, you guys have it rough when you fight awakened Buddha users. Wait, hold on. What is this? A fruit has spawned in the game? Where is it? I got the portal fruit ready. Huh? Taking a look at it, it might be over at... Is that at Sky Islands, maybe? Let me go ahead and uh, portal over to Sky. Wait a second. Is it an upper sky? No, it's not. Where the heck is it? Wait, I'm a bozo. It's at Coliseum. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? Dark fruit, bro? Okay, dark fruit's not that bad, but I think I got max dark fruits. Let's go hunt another player, and then we're gonna be heading over to the second sea after we get another cheek clapping over here. Huh? What is that going on there? A level 2000 over in Midtown? Yo, what's going on, broski? Let me just go ahead and say what's up to you real quick. Let me just go ahead and try comboing him and whoa he's trying to get away oh my gosh his observation is dodging everything but he can't dodge at all oh my gosh oh he's got the sanguine art fighting style this is gonna be interesting oh it kind of damaged me here there we go now we are landing some nice juicy combos on him but everything's on cooldown still oh he's using the midnight blade too what the heck uh oh he's sucking the soul out of me wait hold on that sounds sus no no that's not what i meant there we go the lag didn't even send him backwards when he should have been backwards okay we're just gonna go ahead and awaken here i've had enough of his games we're about to clap bro little does he know and never mind. Oh, just kidding. It finally lands. Bro, what is wrong with bro? His movement is so unpredictable and weird. 8.9 thousand bounty. Huh? He gave me the least bounty out of everybody here in the first seat, but he gave me the most trouble. Ah, oh, but he's a good sport. He said GG, so I'll tell him GG back. For the second seat, I'm gonna use a lot of people's favorite swords, and that is the Rengoku sword. I'm not gonna use no overpowered shark anchor or cursed dual katanas in this video because, you know, I wanna be different. I wanna use the Rengoku and try to slash and dash people. Let's go ahead and see if anybody's willing to fight. Huh? I noticed the max level player over here. Yo, what's going on, broski? Do you have your PvP on? And oh, he absolutely does. He's using the shark anchor. Let's find out which sword is better, his shark anchor or my sword. You know, we could both play this game, broski. You know, I got the Demon Slayer Rengoku sword. I'm just slashing and dashing his observation. That is funny. But I'm gonna go ahead and hit him with the Rengoku combo real quick. Hit him with the God Human combo. Then hit him with the Burning Slash. And whoa, he dodged the Burning Slash? What the heck? I could have sworn that hit him. He went inside his portal realm, but now all I have to do is just kind of wait for him here and he's gonna get comboed. Is he gonna come out or is he gonna stay in his realm? 
What the heck is bro's issue? There he is. Okay, he finally popped out of his shell. Now he's gonna get comboed and what the heck? How did he get comboed and end up behind me? Bloxfruits, explain yourself. There we go. We got him for 12.5 thousand bounty. Huh? For some reason, Bloxfruits still has these McDonald's servers and I don't know why. To be honest, I don't think it's Bloxfruits' fault. It's Roblox's fault. Somebody came up and they're using the Cursed Dual Katanas to fight. Let's go see how this works out. We're gonna go ahead and try to hit him with a burning slash real quick and oh, he was able to dodge that. But he was not able to dodge that Rengoku ability and uh oh, it's a dragon user. Uh oh, this is gonna be a little bit of a problem because he has so much defense. I don't think a sword user is gonna even be able to kill a dragon user. This is ridiculous, boys. And now there's another dragon user trying to third party. This guy is also a dragon user who's trying to target me and there's a dragon user up here. Broski, you gotta be kidding me. We look at two flying furries fighting each other. Okay, I went ahead and got this guy in another combo. He's like half health, but now he's probably gonna try to run away. Oh, it's a blizzard user. Okay, I have the dragon user still targeting me with the blizzard user. I'm spinning in the air now uncontrollably. I don't know what's going on, but I have to fight somebody and I don't know who I'm fighting anymore. Oh, there he is. He's down to half health. This is the guy I was fighting a second ago. And there we go. We killed him. But now there's also other people trying to target us. Look at Broski trying to get his revenge on me. What are you doing, Broski? Let me go ahead and try to combo him. He's down to half health and I missed. Uh-oh. Oh, he awakened? Okay, I could awaken too, buddy. We could both do that. He's angel race, so he's got a lot of heals under his belt, which is a little bit of a problem. But I do have fire to burn him down. Oh, but he's gonna survive with one HP every time, Broski. There we go. That should finish him off for 11.5 thousand bounty. Huh? I don't know how you sword mains do it. My fingers are hurting from mashing the keyboard so much with all these combos. I give you guys credit. All you sword mains out there, shout out to you guys. This hurts my hands. I'd rather just use a blocks fruit. There's somebody walking outside the safe zone. Bro made a fatal mistake trying to stand outside right here. Let's just go ahead and combo him. He's in some serious trouble and for some reason I went up the building, but does it matter? Not really. Let me go ahead and Rangoku combo him and there we go. And now he's just kind of on fire and I think he's accepting his fate. He's not even fighting back. 8.6 thousand bounty. I think we broke the spirit of everybody in the second seat. So you know what that is? I think it's about time to go to the third seat and see how well we could survive as a sword main over there. Now that we're here, it's time to use a super sleeper sword that nobody ever uses for some reason. It got the rework of a lifetime. It is called the dragon trident. Look at the abilities. It looks so cool. First, you have Z ability, which just shoots a water dragon that deals a good amount of damage. But the X ability, look at that. That thing is on a different level. It looks so cool. And from what I heard, if you get hit by that, it like half helps you. It is really, really strong. And if I take a look at the leaderboard, I happen to join Spec while he's playing. And it looks like he's possibly getting bullied by everybody outside over there. So I'm going to go ahead and stand over here and see if anybody will come to me to PvP because, you know, I don't want to ruin Spec's fights. He'll get mad at me. And speaking of Spec, he came up to me and did this emoji and I said, I'm recording. So I hope he doesn't do anything funny. You can't trust this guy. He said, what am I recording? Oh, Spec went to go fight somebody else over there. But I'm recording becoming a sword main Spec. What do you think I'm recording, buddy? He said, good luck. Wait, does he think I suck or something? <laughs> to be honest, I kind of need the luck. I haven't been using any swords recently, so I gotta get used to it. Oh. I didn't even realize. I look at the leaderboard again. Two more friends join and they're 30 million. This lobby is full of sweat. There's this guy over here. Maybe this guy wants to fight me. Let me go ahead and try hitting him with these abilities. There we go. He is getting stuck in all that, but I missed my combo so embarrassingly bad right there. That, that was just disgusting. Close your eyes, guys. Nobody saw anything. Let me just hit him with that and his observation dodge that. Let me just go ahead and hit him with another X ability here, but he's walking away. Bro, come here. I need to try to combo you. There we go. That's what I would like to see. Now we are getting somewhere, boys. The combos are starting to work, or at least the sword. He is down to like a quarter health now. All I have to do is hit him with like one X ability, and there we go. He is in trouble. One more ability, and he is dead. 11,000 bounty. Huh? This thing actually hits pretty hard. You just have to get him stuck in the most perfect combo, but it is very difficult if you don't get it right the first time. I don't see many people main the dragon trident. Am I tripping, or is this thing like pretty good? I just don't know why nobody uses it. There's somebody else coming to challenge me over here. Let me go ahead and see if they got their PvP on. And they absolutely do. 2.7 thousand damage is not a lot. And oh my gosh, it's a rabbit user. These guys are super fast. This might be like the only counter to me because they're extremely difficult to hit the way they move. And when they're in trouble, all they do is run away. But we'll see if this one's a runner or if this one's a fighter. There's only one way to find out. Let's go ahead and try to get our combos right here. We gotta go ahead and go over here. And we gotta go ahead and use our X ability. And whoa, wait a second. Okay, they're landing some pretty good combos here, but I could easily get out of that. Go ahead and do that. Then get him stuck in another ability. Oh, they are running now. I really hope they're not a runner. And from the looks of it, they're actually not that bad at running. This is pretty good. They're playing how they're supposed to play. I love it. Oh, they're taking some damage from that real quick. There we go. We got him stuck in a god human. Wait, we both traded god human. This is hilarious. I'm not going to awaken a V4 yet because I don't want to be that guy. I'll 
respect the 1v1 pretty good here. But if he starts trying to run, I'm going to be upset because I was respecting him. Let's go ahead and do this real quick. Go ahead and do that. Oh, he froze me with 1 HP? No way. Okay, I'm probably going to die here. That is crazy. Oh my gosh, the Blocks Roots gods have denied me a kill. He was 1 HP. Can we get a replay or a snapshot on his health? Oh, he froze me with 1 HP? No way. And look at that. He said 178 HP, bruv. <laughs> this right here is the only rabbit user I respect because he fought me like a man. He recognized me and he's asking for a screenshot. So I told him he's going to be in tomorrow's video. So this guy is 100% respectable. He's a fan. He's a rabbit race user who doesn't run. What more can I ask from a fan? This guy is a huge W. Let's go ahead and fight him one more time. We're going to do a countdown now. We went ahead and counted down. Let's go ahead and see if we can win this fight. This is going to be pretty tough for me still. The dragon trident isn't doing me justice right now when he's using ic is stunning me left and right but i can dodge that which is pretty nice oh he's also using the ascidium rifle i don't typically see that it's been a while oh he's god humaning back let's go ahead and try hitting him with this real quick and oh he was able to dodge that but he is still close to dying we might be able to avenge our death by getting one more hidden oh no we not okay let's go ahead and try this one more time here uh oh we trolled we hit the wrong button boys let's pretend nothing happened we're gonna go ahead and go out here and just you know nothing happened boys we're gonna go ahead and go out then we're gonna go ahead and hit him with the dragon trident or at least try to. He is so close. One shot away from dying and oh my gosh, he survives again with one HP. That is insane, boys. This man has the best luck I think I've ever seen. He's got no number school luck at all. Let's go ahead and try catching up to him and there we go. We got him for 17.8 thousand bounty. He was worth a lot of bounty actually, but he's a W fighter. Oh my gosh. He's saying the dragon trident is so broken for no reason. It really is. If you guys know how to use this dragon trident, maybe a little bit better than I do, you guys can be unstoppable. I didn't even realize if I take a look at the leaderboard, he had 14.6 million bounty too. But I think this is where I'ma cut it off. If you guys enjoyed me trying to be a sword main for the first time in years, go ahead and leave a like and sub and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. Also, don't forget to click on one of these videos on screen.